Hey there, we're Sharon Elstrom here. Welcome to day 228 of our BU 365 day challenge to do one thing every day that improves us in some way. This month we're focusing on confidence. So what better way to spend today's challenge than thinking about a confidence increasing strategy. And that strategy is of course on a card that I pulled for today. And it says, by visualizing my desired outcome, the perfect action is always inspired. And on the back it says, as your desire to feel good leads you to thoughts that feel good, the perfect action will be inspired from that alignment. And that inspired action is always joyful. So what the heck is this confidence increasing strategy? It's to visualize what you want. It's to visualize the outcome that you want in any given situation. Guess what? When we visualize and plan and, and prepare and play out scenarios in our mind, we always feel more confident when we actually get involved in those scenarios. When we think about what it is that we want, how to get there comes to us. So often we spend our time and energy fretting and worrying about, well, all the steps we need to take to get something that we want. And the truth is we only need to think of the very next thing we need to do to move us toward that thing. But by visualizing and imagining the thing that we want as if we've already got it and adding our senses, there's, there's so many tools and things to help us visualize. And you can just Google that. We've talked about a lot of them this year so far. In 228 days, we've talked about visualization dozens of times. So how do you know if it's working? How do you know if the action is actually inspired and something that you should do? Well, it's how does it make you feel? If it makes you feel good or positive or light or optimistic or hopeful or positive in any way, then that is an action that's probably for you. If it in any way makes you feel uncomfortable, negative, doubtful, worried, fearful, any of the negative emotions, then that's probably not the right action for you. It might be the right action for you later, but it's not the right next step, the right action for you now. That's the difference between action and inspired action. It's really easy for us to just act and act and act and act and do all kinds of things that we think are going to move us to the thing that we want. It's like that old in business they talk about instead of just picking a target audience we just throw spaghetti up against the wall meaning we we throw our message out there and we expect people to find us it doesn't work it's it's in the shotgun approach it's not very effective i guess it's better than doing nothing but it's not super effective and we want to make sure that the things that we're doing are going to actually move us toward the results that we want so our action item today is to think about and visualize what it is that you want think of an a scenario or a situation you might find yourself in that you want to feel more confident in and in that imagine it playing out visualize it playing out exactly how you want it to go how you want to look feel dress stand what you want to say and see if that doesn't increase your confidence so Share in the comments below today any aha or inspired action that comes out of that visualization. I'll do the same. Any questions, hit me up. Otherwise, I'll be with you tomorrow.